Alrighty guys, welcome back. Today we're currently back out here on Forza Horizon 5 today. And today I have a brand new mine glitch going to hop straight into and share with you guys here today. Now with today's mine glitch, you guys should be making anywhere from 320,000 credits to 530,000 credits. As well as anywhere from 60,000 XP to 90,000 XP depend on if you have VIP or not, as well as two free wheel spins at the end of this. And you can get all these rewards in under a minute. So overall, a pretty decent money glitch. You do get pretty good rewards in a very short amount of time. So we're going to go and hop straight into this. I hope you guys do enjoy and find this video helpful. Remember, if you guys do, leave a like as well as subscribe and turn on post notifications to stay up to date with more. While you're at it, go ahead and visit the link to my Discord server down below in the description and join that if you're interested. And also have some links to my social medias down below in the description as well. So you can feel free to check those out and drop a follow on any of the social me is they would like to and now with that we're going to go and hop straight into step number one of today's money glitch and i hope you guys enjoy but before we hop straight into today's money glitch if you guys don't want to sit around for hours grinding out these money glitches then you can head on over to mitchcactus.com and check out some of their instant delivery mod accounts which can be applied to a personal account of yours, or you can just purchase a standalone credits and spin pack. They are by far the most highly reputable modders with 5,000 plus verified reviews on their official Trustpilot page. They offer packages for Xbox, PC, and Steam, ranging between 50 million to 999 million credits accounts. There will be a link in the pinned comment below as well as in the description. And be sure to use code DRAGSTER for 5% off your purchase. And now with all that out of the way, let's hop straight into today's money glitch and I hope you guys enjoy. Alrighty guys, so hopping straight into step number one of today's money glitch. What you guys are going to need is a specific vehicle. So we're going to go on over here into cars, then select like change car. And the car we're going to be looking for is going to be the 2014 Local Motors Rally Fighter. You can pick up one of these in the auto show for only 100,000 credits. And that's honestly not bad because you can use this car to make a lot of money. And uh, you have to keep it stock as well. So don't even put a tune on it or anything. Or if you do put a tune on it, at least make sure it's a rear wheel drive tune. So pretty much once you have one of these cars right here, the next place we're going to go is over here to the creative hub. And then we're going to select the event lab. And then we're going to select event blueprint. Now from here, go ahead and pull up your search bar and go in and click on share code. And then you're going to want to type in this share code right here. 192-780-836. Then you're going to go ahead and confirm that search and you're going to find this blueprint right here. And then from here, it's going to enter a solo race event from in this blueprint. And make sure to go ahead and select your local motors rally fighter. So now from here, once loaded into the race event, go on into difficulty and settings and select your difficulty setting. Now from here, pretty much just copy down exactly what is up on the screen right here. Now essentially by doing that, you guys will be getting a plus 100% difficulty bonus credit. So pretty much once you've copied down these difficulty settings here, you're good to go ahead and just start the race event. And then from here, once you're in the race event, just go ahead and follow my lead. We're gonna go ahead and drive through the first checkpoint here and then we're coming up on the second one. After we drive through the second one, we're gonna drive right up here and then hang a sharp right until we come over here to these tunnels. And then we're gonna go ahead and push in that container and drive into the tunnel and then apply your handbrake. So from here, just go ahead and hold your handbrake. Your car is gonna bug out for a second. It'll end up right here. It's just gonna sit there doing a little burnout for I'd say the next 10 to 15 seconds. And then you're gonna load out and get all your rewards. All right, just like that, about 10 seconds later, the race event is now going to complete and it's time to get our reward. So from this, we did make 77,000 XP right there. Uh, one wheel spin right here at the end, and then we're gonna get two more after we load out. And just like that, as you guys can see, 77,000 XP right there, and then 517,000 credits. And then as you guys can see down there, it just said wheel spin earned. So overall, not bad rewards. Depending on your loading times, like if you have very fast loading times, you can get this done easily in under a minute, minute 30. Uh, if you have very fast loading times, that is. But if you have a little bit slower loading times, that's the only thing you're waiting on because you're only in the glitch race event itself for, I'd say, about 30 seconds in total. So honestly, not bad at all for the rewards you do get get at the end. But yeah, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for today's video. I hope you guys did enjoy and find today's video helpful. Remember, if you guys did, leave a like as well as subscribe and turn on post notifications to stay up to date with more new videos. And with that, thank you guys so much for watching. And with that, I'll catch you guys very, very soon in the next one.